uh, playing uh, for North Adelaide in South Australia. What a great club that is, North Adelaide. And uh, <laughs> saw him play last year in this championship. Very, very good, Tahana. Chance here over the top. It ends up back with Georgeson. And now Bonner. Allen. Port gets a runner out wide in Tahana. Tahana finds his target. And this is the 39 at the other end, the leading forward, Allen, for South Australia. He's been impressive early. I know we talked about Kieran Collins having a great uh, championships, but so far, Matty Allen's got the better of that contest. And a boy that started the year playing Colts in SA kicked a couple of bags of six, 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 and then three, and then was back to school footy, and then into the championships. But he has agree, he has been impressive. So it's a testing kick right on the 50 metre line. Angle. But there you have it. Beautiful, yeah. Beautiful kick. And we're seeing Shaq hit one end, Allen the other. And they're making kicking goals from 50 metres look easy. Some people can turn up here on, for an AFL game and they wonder why players can't kick goals from here. These young men can. Well, that's the beauty for the clubs too, is they can evaluate talent at, at an actual AFL venue. And for, uh, for Matty Allen to go back there and just, uh, just, just drain it on his left foot yep. from 50 metres, that's a big tick for the AFL clubs riding in their notebooks now. Yep. And a good setup from Stephen Tahana to uh, the inside mid... Uh, for SA, a boy that uh, a couple of years back won the MVP at under 16 level when South Australia uh, played. Persistence won out again for South Australia, so they're winning some ball in the contested situations. Mackenzie tried to tap it over towards Allen, he goes down on it, got to be careful there. He's yeah, won a free kick for in the back. I think it was there too, yeah. he, uh, just a little bit clumsy there by Kieran Collins, just fell into the back of uh, Allen when he was over the football. So we saw Allen with a nice leg before, now take a look at this, he just sort of drops into him there. Yeah. yeah. But I guess Collins was just desperate to try and find the footy. Yeah, I mean, he was just hunting the ball, yeah. He was just hunting the ball. It was... The attitude was right. It was just the, the way he went about it. So we saw Allen with a beautiful kick from 50 metres. This time he's only going to kick from 30. A bit of an angle for the left footer. But from what we've seen so far, the kicking for goal from both teams has been good. And the goal umpire never has to move. So they're having an easy job from the set shots. The goal umpires, two to Allen, three in a row to South Australia. Game on, eight points. This is a really good contest. And yep. uh, we shouldn't forget, Matty, these two teams played each other two weeks ago. And Kieran Collins, number 37 for Vic Country, was probably the best player on the excellent. ground that day. So um, today he's had his uh, colours lowered a little bit by, by Matty Allen. But uh, he's got a fantastic uh, character, Kieran Collins. He'll definitely bounce back. And that's the beauty of this format now, the home and away format that sees the six games played and the chance to actually learn about your opposition, get your match... This is a coaching panels, get the yep. matchups right and for the kit... Maybe two or three weeks away if he continues his upward trend at the moment. So, but he's really pleasing. Like, he's got some real blue skies. This week he finds himself playing in the National Championships for South Australia, but he's also played league football for Glenelg already as a 16-year-old. So... He's had uh, one of those seasons where he's playing under a lot of different coaches. A little bit of trouble for got behind him. That's a lovely kick. And Alan, he, nice. did, he did well. He just made good position, but the kick was a beauty. It was from Cone. So Alan, for his third, he's been good at kicking for goal. So he hasn't let himself down or his teammate given his opportunities. He's kicked three, second for the quarter for South Australia. And he's doing his prospects no harm whatsoever. It's been good today, Manny Allen. He really uh, has been using his body well in marking contests, but probably, probably along with Snelling, uh, South Australia's most influential player on the ground. Yeah, it was a clever kick, wasn't it, though? Put it right out in front. Not much Collins could do there. Lovely mark. Well, they're in this game, Matty. Four goals. Well, certainly their effort um, since three-quarter time would show that they still believe they can win the game. Well, their tackle count is there. They're plus 15 on the yeah. country, so they've had 57 tackles. So the effort certainly...